But Kirby only dominated the news for 24 hours, for Game 7 would be the greatest World Series pitching duel of all time. Jack Morris won 162 games in the 80s, more than anyone. But in 1991, he was 36. I watched the Tigers as a kid, and Jack Morris was one of my favorite guys to watch pitch. John Smoltz was only 24, and so this generational face-off got underway. Smoltz off on the right foot with a strikeout. You're watching it and you have an appreciation as to how well each pitcher is pitching, but in the back of your mind, you're hoping that when Jack goes out to the mound, it's going to be the inning that he loses it, and you're just constantly waiting for that inning, and, and that inning never came. Even when the Braves threatened in the eighth, the Wiley Morris managed beautifully. When TK came out, he smiled, and I just stood there like, I'm going to kill you if you take me out. I said to him, Jack, I said, you've done more than enough. He said, I'm all right. I said, oh, hell, it's just a game. Go ahead, Vic. And the play is to home. Out there. Out there. It was bad on the nerves. It was just incredible. It just went on and on and on. Atlanta has been scored in 10 innings against Jack Morris. Smoltz had been lifted in the eighth. And two innings later, with the man on third, it was over. The Twins are going to win the World Series. It's a one nothing 10 inning victory. I said it a couple times. It's a great game, guys. This is a beautiful game. And it was. It was just a classic. <laughs> 